Sarah Palin. Governor, good to see you. Nice to see you, Sean. All right. You know, when you think of the president's lecture um, after Gabrielle Giffords, when you think you were in the middle of that debate because you had targeted districts, which has been done, you know, for decades, um, and the, the assault on your character and the attempts to somehow connect you and the Tea Party to all of this, and then here's the, the vice president of the United States and a U.S. congressman, and they just dismiss it. This is nothing. How do, how do you react to that? Well, the president's speech in Arizona as he asked folks to start ratcheting down the rhetoric um, was all talk. He wasn't sincere in that, and that's typical Barack Obama, unfortunately. That is typical of our president where it's blah, blah, blah. You know, it's, it, it's all talk and, and no real action. Otherwise, he'd be on Biden and tell Biden to, um, to tone it down a little bit. Yeah, right. Independent, patriotic Americans who desire fiscal sanity in our beloved nation being called terrorists. Heck, Sean, if, if we were real domestic terrorists, shoot, President Obama would be wanting to pal around with us, wouldn't he? I mean, he didn't have a problem uh, palling around with uh, Bill Ayers back in the day when he kicked off his uh, political uh, career in Bill Ayers' apartment and then, you know, shaking hands with Chavez and saying he doesn't need any preconditions with meeting uh, um, dictators or, or uh, wanting to read U.S. Miranda rights to alleged sus suspected foreign terrorists. No, if we were real domestic terrorists, I think uh, President Obama wouldn't have a problem with us.